Hey guys, me here and I'm back and today I'm going to be recording the video about this hungry man's Mexican style fajitas. And this food, I'm not lying, is a 17 grams of protein. And now they, why is there stuff about, an, what is this, fajitas or enchiladas? Get it right. Yeah, like, okay, I'm having enchiladas, not fajitas, but these look like enchiladas for some reason. Like, I don't know. Now I'm thinking about it. But here's what it has. It has coconut flavored pudding, refried beans, Mexican rice, chili sauce, and cheese. So, remove the, f remove the film. So I remove the film over the refried beans. Yeah, I'm going to put the phone down. Um, I just don't want anything to put them. I'm going to use this hot sauce bottle, actually. Here we go. I'm going to record myself. Okay, I'm recording myself now setting this up. So step one is open it up over the refried beans. Whoop. Probably okay. Yeah, I need to do record this way. So guys, hey, this is my cameraman. I'm not even gonna show his face. Are you recording this right now? What's up guys? So I'm gonna be putting this on here for five minutes. Five minutes. Whoops. I'm real about to get this picture of my mom. What? Time cook. Where's the time cook? Press the five. It didn't work. Press timer, right? No. Wait, let me see the box. Um, it says put it in there for um five minutes. The refried beans. Remove the pudding. Remove the filthy pudding. I can't. Right, how do I? No, no, never mind. No. I ring it wrong. You did. Wait. Look over hot for five minutes. Then stir. The refried beans. Yeah, rearrange the enchiladas and stir the refried beans. And replace the filmer's under tray to the microwave oven and put it in there for. Okay, I'll record now. Okay. Is, okay, he's gonna be working the microwave because uh, this is. This is his house, not mine. Too much. This is my, not my house. This is his. But this is <laughs> if you're But I'm letting him help me with the microwave part. But no, listen here. This video is no way sponsored because I'm too little a YouTube channel. Oh here, set do it. two food reviews one. We're as well gonna try the Hungry Man's. These are the cheesy fries with the chicken tenders. No what? Right, cheesy fries with chicken tenders. Cheesy fries are actually really good. Now, guys, listen. One rule is I'm doing this based off of TV dinner standards. This isn't. I'm not comparing this to an actual meal. I'm gonna just do a close up real quick. You see, fry of cheese. I'm right. These are wedge style too. Here's what this meal looks like. There was more in there, but I ate some already. So it's just dinner, guys. Let me know, guys. I'm just gonna tell a story or something. This may be in a longer video. Oh yeah, and screw YouTube right now. Screw you, YouTube. I want. I would flick you off, but I don't want to be in trouble with the YouTube algorithm. Yes. Because one thing is, guess what YouTube does now? Makes it where I have a thousand subscribers to live stream. Dude, it's unfair. But guess what happens? PC. But everybody who records on PCs gets to use gets to live stream. Whoops. It's a live stream. This is infuriating. I want to rant. But instead of ranting, I'm just going to tell a story about the dumbest stuff. I'm just going to tell some dumb stories. This may be a long video, actually. But dumb story number one. I know. <laughs> this, this soda bottle still made the... Hello. Hey. 
And why don't you begin both just to tell stories, dude? Just for this talk, just dumb, dumb and funny stories. And this may be a little bit of a longer video because I kind of owe y'all after not uploading for two months, recording 10 different videos and thinking to upload them because I was too nervous. And then lost all that footage. So random one is guys is here's throughout this video I'll tell random stories. Sorry, I'm hungry. Okay. Five. But no. But what I'm gonna say is, is story number one is gonna be a dumb one. When I was around two or three, um, before I give this sermon to little context, I'm a clumsy child. Still am to this day. With that in mind, remember, here's, here's the story. When I was around two or three, I was running around as a little kid, and, and I don't remember who it was. I think it was one of my mom or dad's friends. And they were messing around with me, and I tripped over their foot, and I fell and ended up hitting my head against the wall really hard. Not uh, say anything graphic because it would count as graphic content. Yeah, I don't know why. But no, guys, and I was running around, I ended up cracking my head open. Yeah, it was a dumb time of my life. Okay, let's go do a little bit of an update. We are at a minute. A minute. My camera sucks because I'm horrible. I haven't recorded in forever, but guys, the video's gonna be messed up. I don't care. And editing, I'm not, I'm not gonna edit this video, it's gonna be uncut footage. Because I am, I regret, regret saying that. Not that it actually smells good, doesn't it? It smells like a TV in here. Yeah. Oh. I'm gonna try to, yeah, they're not here, I'm gonna try the chicken. I think you had a friend, yeah. The fries are good. Chicken review. I'm gonna try some of the breading, guys. I'm gonna try the breading itself real quick. Did you already put it on three minutes? Oh, for, um, not yet. Oh. Then, guys, look at this. I had to stir it. But the breading tastes weird to me. Ooh. You're gonna put that bubbling? Tell me, I want to say this looks good. Before we stir it, I'm going to put it, I'm going to show the recording. Is that the pudding that's bubbling? No, it's the interlock. No, look at the pudding, too. <laughs> okay, my one complaint is... Okay. Look at this. Okay, guys. I'm going to, uh, later in the video, guys... It looks disgusting right now. Early in the video, guys, listen here. This is a TV dinner, so it looks disgusting. But ask me, did it look disgusting at first for you, too? No. I'm gonna do the chili cheese fries though. They got natural cheese fries. The fries, do they look weird? No. Was that called hard cheese? Like, it's Around there and all that. Yeah, it was just frozen at first, so. Yeah, it's like cheese in the middle of it. Look at these. These don't these look disgusting, but I'm frozen and it tastes really good. Yeah, just one complaint is why hot pudding? We rearranged the. Um, the um I gotta stir them first. Oh, you don't have to stir the um, enchiladas. All you have to do is rearrange them. No, oh yeah, um, no, we're still gonna use a spoon though because we can't touch it because it's burning hot. Yes, these are, I wanna record them. But yes, guys, when you're following the instructions, we're gonna do this. Actually, follow the instructions because you, there's a chance you can end up messing stuff up. Like, you know what I'm talking about? On the top of TV dinners, I used to be, I used to eat kids with cuisine a lot. I don't know if you, have you ever had kids with queen, kids cuisine? Oh, yeah. 
And my dad messed up by accident. He left something in there. And it ruined everything. Because what happens is, you're not supposed to put, like, what if, like, kids was cuisine chicken nuggets? You're supposed to take out the chicken nuggets before you make it. Oh, he didn't do that. He left a couple of them in there, and it ended up making everything else really weird. Because what it is, is because once you take them out, all the heat is directed for something else. Left them in there by accident. Everything was cold, but the chicken nuggets were not. It wasn't bad. We just had to remake it. (laughs) But no, guys, like, so, like, in the comments, tell me, how stupid is it that they don't, that the pudding has to be hot? Like, why hot pudding? I'd rather have my pudding be... Are you like beans? Yep. Oh, yeah, these are beans right here. Hey guys, here in Florida, we have this restaurant at Mona Polera, which is really good Mexican food here. This looks like, this looks like they're beans, yeah. but a lot more, because, like I said earlier, I'm not comparing this to a real meal. Like, you can ask him, this is not a real meal. Are you good? I wasn't doing anything. Dude, it's okay. Dude, you're making it, you, remember though, remember, remember though. But guys, listen. I was in here. I went to the one Mexican, um, one Mexican restaurant with my friend before. From school, but he doesn't go to my school anymore. He goes to his neighborhood school, and like we had went to this Mex- Me- Mexican restaurant, bro. They had the burritos; those were good, and they had like rice and like beans. Three minutes. You're pressed to start right into it, right there. Oh, go ahead. Yeah, here to tell your story. And like we had rice and beans, and that was like it was just good. It was just busting. Yeah, guys, but listen here. Like I said earlier, we're not comparing this. Like, I'm not comparing this to real Mexican food. Because one thing is, these are TV dinners. Like, swear to God, guys, if y'all comment below, like, wow, you gave it way too good review. I feel like this is really good. Yeah, no. Come on, guys. TV dinners, they're not meant to be cuisines. And, like, the name Kids to Queen, Cuisine, Cuisine, Cuisine. Guys, look, I'm not even gonna edit that out. Just show you that I'm a real, that I'm a real person and can and will mess up all the time. I'm not like one of those YouTubers who just cut out every mistake. But no, because I don't wanna do that yet. What did you ask me to do? Making every new But anyways, but listen, the dumb part about this is, I have a feeling that eventually, when twenty ten gets bigger, that people are gonna find this video. And say, like, oh, my God, he's, like, way too generous with this. Dude, if you think I'm giving these good reviews based off of actual food, like, come on. Have you ever, if you can have a TV dinner that tasted like actual restaurant food, then that is... Okay, guys, we got one minute. And with hungry man, okay, guys, I'm gonna give a little bit of a shout out to one of my one of the YouTube early. Like he started this trend. His name is Brutal Moose. His videos called Brutal Foods, and I think um the one that he had these are like the newest ones I think right now are Select series, which are, I think are bigger versions of their originals. Cause I I think I well, before this was made, I remember seeing this meal around. Remember, guys, he ate it all. He ate most of it already. This is the whole thing. But I think I've seen these around. But it was. But there was two different versions. There was this version with chicken tenders and fries. And then there was cheese fries. Separate. These are combined meals. Like with the one I have, it's they're like bigger enchiladas. Want some mini cap? But anyway, it's like earlier today we were listening to the Knife Cave song by Rusty Cage. And we were messing around. I failed in like the first five seconds of the game starting. And it's ready. Wait, we gotta let it sit in the microwave for one minute. Should I open it real quick? Oh, don't leave it open. Oh, close it actually? Actually, 
Okay, guys, you can hear. I'm ASMR real quick. Yeah, that's what it sounds like. That's the pudding and enchilada stuff. <laughs> I don't like my pudding sizzles. That isn't right. Pudding isn't supposed to sizzle. It's supposed to not sizzle. That makes no sense. But like coconut pudding, okay, no, that actually sounds really good right now. But guys, I'm gonna record myself eating some of it. Not all of it, because I found out real, but I'm gonna record that and make a video later on. I'm gonna post this. And the video, and guys, funny thing is, is, I'm actually enjoying recording right now because it's been so long. I feel like I cheated y'all out. I feel like I've just make. I've made so many. It's been so long since I watched a recorded video. Oh, I have like two. <laughs> I just want to be real. I'm hoping that one day when my channel gets big. No, what you need to do is start gaming. I think that's overrated. I know, but it can help you get subscribers faster. Fine. Okay, fine. Listen. Okay. If my view, I only have two subscribers. If y'all, I will start using D record. Okay, fine. If I do this, you're gonna I'm recording my gameplays on with a D recorder, which is something my friends use. Go subscribe to her. Her channel is like Gotcha from Fox. And so, you're not Gotcha from Fox, Sushi Neko now. Just saying. And I think I'm ready to take it out. So the camera is going to be like this. Okay. Okay, so the camera's perfect. I'll be right back. Big reveal. Whoo. Yikes, it's hot. Ah, oh, that's hot. Hey guys. Ah, oh, that's hot. <laughs> you get the joke, it's a Will Smith meme. <laughs> Not about to hear what I said, right? You're in the Will Smith meme when he says, Ah, oh, that's hot. Remember, remember, remember when Will Smith says, ah, that's hot? Yeah. I woke up to my meal and go, ah, that's hot. <laughs> Memes. Here we go, guys. This is this is pretty hot, though. Mm. Review on the chili sauce. Know it? Really good. Actually, pretty good, guys. But at my mid video, you're gonna. I'm gonna take a picture of it real quick. Yeah, guys, this is really weird. You ready? Number one, guys, I'm actually about to try the pudding first. Come, okay, already one complaint. Pudding is not so, okay. So weird, actually, hey guys. Okay, complaint already number one. I'm um, recording it yet. Yeah, no, this is clean. Everyone is look at this. You know what? I give the pudding a 10 out of 10. No, 10 I'm just kidding. It's like a 5 out of 5. 5 out of 10. 
It's just it tastes weird being hot. We tried beans. I swear to God, guys, I'm not gonna. Rec hot. Ooh. Just cooked. Here it is. What? Pretty good. Now for the main meal. What I actually have to eat is in. Beef, Mexican style enchilada, which I think I got a mixed print, guys, because um, if you go back in the very beginning of the video, it said Mexican style fajita, but everywhere else says enchilada, which means mine is probably a misprint. But no, uh, I'm ready for this. If I say, I swear to God, guys, this is the if this isn't good, I'm just gonna eat two things and I'll let him try it. And what? Want to get her? Want to um, try it too? You want to try enchilada? Sure. Just uh, put it on a napkin for me. Oh, I need you to come over here real quick. So I'm, I'm going to let you try it first. Go for it real quick. Are you going to try it first? This is yours. I'll get his reaction too, guys. Just to show I'm not faking my reaction. And see if he has the same reaction as me. Chili sauce taste. Whoo, hot, hot, hot. Not spicy. The, the t okay, the tortilla is really good. So I beat the beef. You know what? With this meal so far, or my review, is around a 5 out of 10. No, not 5 out of 10, 6 out of 10. I want to see his reaction to the pudding and the um, enchiladas. Yeah, you want to grab your fork and you can come over here and try it real quick? If you like it, I'll give you one on after if you like it. I was gonna see if you want, I was gonna be a fork too, just so you can try it, see if you like it. No. Hammer? Okay, um, you may want to grab your plate already, dude, then. Dude, remember though, these are messy too, because remember they're on a, uh, remember they have sauce on them? So you probably want to bring your plate over right next to it once I pick it up for the nap. Again. Here's the, I remember, um, one thing. Yeah, guys, here's what the one I'm giving him looks like. I already bit off of one, so I'm going to be running a bit off. But guys, I'm going to end the video here. I'm going to eat this. Smells good Pudding's really good. I'll record a video after I eat. Well, bye.